one more time, brother. You can introduce yourself right now. Man, absolutely. Hey, what's up, guys? My name is Oliver Novazetis, aka the Spiritual Investor. I'm actually a full-time investor in Yogi. I started playing Dota about 10 years ago, man, and I literally nice. I fell in love with the game. You know, I stopped playing probably you know, something like seven, eight years ago, and I don't know what it was. About nine, ten months ago, I ended up finding your channel, and I saw you playing a game with Unero, and Unero, Blade Master, was one of my favorite heroes, man, when I was playing and I watched you go godlike, and from there on, I've been watching almost every single day. You know, just recently downloaded Dota. Now I got an account on iCup um, under Nova354, and I think I'm like 13-3 and three right now, man. So I've just been loving it, been getting back in the game, and I'm a huge Dota fan. I love every type of hero. I love playing Agi carries a lot of times, but yeah, I love every hero. So I'm excited to watch, I'm excited to commentate, and fucking love your channel bro love nice brother thank you man thank you brother for following by the way we are watching today group h we are watching panda versus shock game club both teams are from uzbekistan i don't know if you are familiar familiar with server a lot of uzbekistan players are here and they are very good in playing it so will be interesting to watch tonight's game uh favorites for tonight i think it is panda team they are one of the strongest on tournament so we'll see how they will play tonight Okay. I'm excited, man. Just even watching some of the replays, there's been so much incredible teamwork. You know, and that's, uh, I mean, if you have good chemistry and people are playing their, their roles, you know, support's doing the right thing, the carries are, you know, making sure they're getting kills, they're not dying. It's just, uh, it, it's absolutely amazing. And, um, you know, when you're playing five on five really good players, you know, it's just, it's who performs, you know, it's who executes. So I'm excited to see who executes in this game and uh, takes over. Yeah, I hope we will see nice team play definitely from at least from Panda team I expect because they're favorites and another team I'm not familiar with these players so we'll see how they will play. I'm hoping to see a lot of team play on tournament because that is what every team needs for win. So it will be hard for every of these teams to win the tournament because a lot of strong players playing it. And what about you, man, for your guys' team? Do you like uh, more or less being support and helping out the team, or do you like to carry and kind of just take over? Right now, I like more carry, like, because I am solo farming while my team is ganking and doing stuff around. So that's why I think it's good for me to play carry, definitely. They are, they are all Russian speakers, Uzbekistan, actually, speakers, and I am not the one. So it's hard for me a little bit to communi communicate with my teammates, but we can go, like, always with moves. For example, they can say, Balta, go, come here, or something like that, they can say. So we can do perfect fit for now. We'll see how it goes with harder teams. By the way, we are watching right now, Spectra and Zeus are picked in. This is Scourge side, Panda team picking this strong combo we watched this combo playing many times on tournament so far and i think one of the strongest definitely in tournament let's see what shock game club they what they can do for countering this kunka is picked by the way first what do you think about spectra zeus combo so far oh man i i absolutely love it you know i absolutely love it and just again the fact that you know a lot of spec you can be a tank you, you can take a lot of damage and obviously you know initiating and zeus comes in and just takes it down so I'm really excited to see, but I will say as well, obviously, you know, the other side took Kunka right away. And Kunka, to me, man, if you're a good player, Kunka's one of the best heroes. And there we go with Necro. That's a beautiful combo. X marks the spot with Necro ult. Ooh, I'm yeah, excited to see man. that. Yeah, definitely, bro. Definitely. And also, don't forget, Kunka's ship can actually save his teammates to prevent damage from, prevent nuke from Zeus and Spectra. You have that delay on your damage when you are using ship over your teammates. So very useful, especially against this combo. Now I'll say this, ball because I've seen in a lot of one of your good games, you know, you'll have a good Kunka on your team. And it's so important. I would say Kunka is one of those heroes. If you play well with him, he's going to take your team to the next level. But if you, if you mess up with Kunka, if you miss a couple attacks, you miss a couple nukes, man, he's, uh, he's, I, I feel like he can really hurt your team. So Kunka, uh, that's a bold pick. Yeah, play. yeah, definitely. Like you can you you can take a lot of kills, but if you fail, you will get late level six, which means you are useless until you get it, and then everything is delayed for your team, even like ganks, even farm gold, everything. So you must do your kunka play perfectly if you want to succeed in in playing it. 
And, you know, that's what I love so much about Dota, Balt, which, I mean, you, you obviously, you know, you show so much. It's like, if you don't play correctly, you know, you're just, your team's going to lose. But that's what's so much fun about Dota. It's, it's all about, it's the perfect timing. It's the chemistry. And, uh, you know, to me as well, you got to have your energy good before you play as well. And mm. one thing I always make sure before when I play Dota, my mind's always in a good place. I'm positive. Because, man, if you try to play Dota and your energy's messed up, it's going to be a tough game. Yeah, but true. If you're feeling good, you know, if you got a good mindset, yeah, you know, I'm never, never on the phone, never texting. I'm always, it's just Dota when I'm playing Dota. Don't, don't fuck with me. Yeah, man, that that's how it should be, definitely, because you must have, like you said, that team chemistry, and you cannot do it with negative energy. So yeah. Okay, we are live, by the way, right now. Thank you, Gringa, for my lemonade. My Tamara is here, always supporting me. Okay, let's see. They are picking Slardar with combination or with Spectra, so that's a really good combo. Also, Spectra can close kills with Slardar ulti. Like, he can see also tracked heroes. Spectra can see tracked heroes from Slardar and then jump any time, which is really awesome to have, like, Slardar on team. Always you can deal that extra physical damage against minus armor. So really nice pick. Yeah, and if, if he can get, the, you know, that quick dagger and quick armlet, I mean, Slard is one of those heroes that can take over the game. And what a counter pick, though, with the Phoenix. Whoa. I mean, that's, man, talk about another hero. I love this team so far. I mean, Phoenix is one of the heroes in the game. If you play Phoenix correctly, he can take your team to the next level. But, you know, if you miss an ult, if you do something wrong with Phoenix, it can it can take away the game. So I'm really, man, this is going to be... This is gonna be a great game. I'm. I really like Polo Thirty Four. I love their pick so far. Yeah, man. By the way, you have already one positive comment in chat. I can see. I already like him. Someone saying. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Hey, and I'm gonna go on Instagram on my phone. I'm actually gonna live stream this. So all my followers can see. We should get a couple hundred more people on. So. I'm excited, Why not? Man. Why not? Nice, man. Perfect. Let's get him on, man. Let's get him supporting. When just picked another support for. Scourge side, Scourge side playing Panda team, Sentinel side, Shock game club. So, Wench Slardar will be, I guess, supports. Wench will be probably full support, while Slardar will be 4k, which we call here. You just go and gank, you don't buy wards or courier. Okay, now we are waiting for Shock game club to pick fourth hero. Okay, let's see what could be here. Perfect fit. By the way, they do not they do not have still some physical damage or everything about Shock Game Club team. It's all about magic damage. So I think they should pick something for faster pushing. They cannot have uh, like fast hours with these heroes. So they need somebody who can really attack strongly. Trax is ban banned, by the way. Sven could be also an option. We we see this many times with with Phoenix and also with Kunka. Yeah, you're absolutely right. That'd be a great combo. And you know, Balt, the something that's not talked about enough is is the power of lane pushing. And man, if you can get some early towers, oh, there you, man, he's a mind reader. Oh man, look at that spend <laughs> <laughs> Nice oh, prediction, that's, yeah. <laughs> that's God's strength right there, bro. <laughs> <laughs> experience, bro. Experience is real. <laughs> Oh man, and I just uh, I just threw you on my Instagram live too, man. So I'm excited to see who. who okay, I want to say then everybody on Instagram, Olivers, hello to everybody. Welcome on Dota One game. I hope you will have great time, especially for people who played this game a long time ago, like we all did, like 12 years ago. It started actually, for my perspective, even even 14 years ago. So depends when you started, but it is a really long time ago. Hey, did you ever play like the original, you know, Frozen Throne game where, right, you're playing one versus one, you know, you, you have a hero and you're, you're building all those. Yeah, you know, it's that's like how that's how I started, actually. That's how I started. And then my brother came to me and he asked me, why don't you play with one hero? You have a map with one hero. Why don't you play it? It's called Dota. And I was like, what, really? And then I started playing and I really like it. And that's how it everything <laughs> started. <laughs> oh, man. Whoa, Tiny speak, by the that's way. David. That's really strong pick, man. I love it. So far, really strong pick from 
Panda team. Also from yeah, also from Shock Game Club team. I like this. I really love like uh, a lot of magic damage coming in early games. So will be also interesting to see how it goes in early stage of the game. Late game, I am still saying I think Panda team can win late game, early game, definitely Shock Game Club. So depends on how players will play in beginning. Will be interesting to see. You know, this is, uh, I mean, Panda has, I mean, on paper, an amazing team. But so much about Dota, as you know, is it's it, who's going to execute. You know, who's going to take over the lane. Who's going to make sure they're making smart plays. And you know, a lot of times I watch people get a little too over-aggressive farming. Yeah, I'm all for farming. All, I'm all for, you know, you want to get, you know, fed early game. But it's never worth dying. You know, if you have to back up, if, if you have to go home and heal, it's always worth it. Do not die trying to just get a last hit on a creep. Yeah, 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 man. It can slow you down really a lot, so you must be careful, definitely. By the way, Skyrat is picked her last pick, so that's a lot of magic damage. Even Skyrat is magic damage dealer, so they have a lot of power in early game. I think this will be very interesting. Wow, I'd love to see that Sky Zeus combo, man, or a battle. That's gonna be that's gonna be intense. I'm excited for that. You guess Sky will go mid. You know, I, it'll have to see. Sky or, uh, or Necro. You know, Necro's a great solo mid as well. So, yeah, we'll have to see. Yeah, let's see, guys. This is game number one between Panda and versus Shock Game Club. By the way, Panda is playing Scourge side. Sentinel side will playing Shock Game Club. So, let's go. Game can start right now. Let's do it. Okay. You can introduce lanes if you like. What? Uh, you can introduce lanes if you like, uh, like which hero is going in which lane. Okay, perfect. Okay, perfect. So who are we gonna have mid? Let's see so far. Okay, looks like we got Phoenix bot so far on the Sentinel. Nope, looks like he's going middle. I would recommend you to turn out, turn off uh, music from the game, uh, World of Music. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can oh. hear it right here. <laughs> okay. So Sorry about that. Guys. Oh, it's coming. Maybe first blood here on bot lane. Look at this. I was oh. gonna say, I'm not gonna introduce anything. We got it. We have already attack, man. Look at this, Slardar. Going aggressive on Sven. Sven is falling down, but Phoenix healing. Wow. Slardar will. With a perfect stun. Oh, wow. Slardar died instead first, and Sven second Great. one. Torrent will not connect. Okay, actually on Spectre will connect. Spectre now in trouble. This could be actually double kill for Sentinel side. Shot game club. Can they take? And there goes Sky. Uh, there, there goes Phoenix on the sun oh. ray. Let's see. There we go. Perfect. Yep. Double kill for wow. Shot Game Club. Not bad start. Wow. Oh my goodness. I had no idea they were going to be so aggressive to start. We saw four, four members of the Scourge already going into the Sentinel's Forest to start the game. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Alright, I'm going to turn off the sound effects here too. I just love the sound effects, man. That's you just can so just like fun. lower down in like a little bit. That's how uh, what I do. Down. Lower down on 50% maybe. Cool. Yeah, I'll go like 35. That's perfect. Okay. Okay, mid lane. Oof, tiny staying barely alive. He got bottle already, so he will be fine. Bot lane will be more in most interesting, I guess. Triple lane versus triple lane. Top lane, we are watching Necro versus Zeus. That that should be even lane. <laughs> oh my gosh. I mean, it's so funny to see the three versus three live right now. It's just, oh my gosh. So yep. many powerful heroes. Both yeah, teams. Oh, Phoenix attempt, but nice torrent plays perfectly to stop any kind of attacks. Sven is low on mana always, so he can always throw one stun and then he's like out. That's the one problem with this hero. And I guess that's why most of the teams don't decide to go with Sven. It's hard with him 
to go on beginning and in mid game he's very strong. Late game he falls off a little bit, so very risky hero to play with. Very true, man, but if he can get that arm lit and God's strength, my goodness, I means Sven can take over a game instantaneously. But yeah, we got Zeus and we got Necro top. You know, they're just going at it. They're farming with bot lane. You're right. It's ridiculous. We have three well, two versus two, three versus three right now. Absolutely amazing. So much action. Okay, so far, nine creeps for Sven. Spectra have four creeps, so... Sven is getting better timing time uh, on bot lane. Mid lane, tiny, three creeps oh. only. Here they go. Oh, Here we go. Torrent will hit three oh, people, oh, man. Oh. Nicely done. Oh. But Phoenix will go down. F Spectra taking a kill. This is huge for Spectra. Great oh. stun by Slard. Yep, they want wow. more, man. They want more. There is stun on Slardar. Can he do it? Yep, Sven. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh Kunka goes. will go down. Man, two kills wow. for Spectre is huge on beginning. You're so right, Balton. Did you see how Slard was running around with almost no no hit points and got off that incredible stun? Yeah, perfectly wow. positioned, yeah. And he did, did he survive? No, he, he died actually, right? At the end. He did that. Yeah, yeah, he died. Oh, look at this mid. Oh, Sven. Oh, uh, Tiny died, bro. Solo kill by Skyrat. It's really also amazing pickup, and it will be now big advantage on mid lane. Killing spree level five. Be careful. He can take over the game level six. Wow. Yeah, once he start ganking on all lanes, it will be very difficult for Panda team to survive. You know, involved so funny. I know you'll resonate with this. I mean, Dota is such a team game, but at the same time, it's so much. If one player takes over, the game can be over right away. Yeah, you know, definitely. You one, one hero to get fed. <laughs> but the thing <laughs> is, it. you can come back always if you have good team play. That's also very important to say. Okay, look at this under the rune, tiny, tiny trying. Oh! Damn. What t man? I really like this sky rate. My goodness. Man, he survived there on two hits, more like perfectly done. I, I want, uh, I wanted to say like you can always come back if you have perfect team play. You can always gank that one hero who is dominating the game. You can catch him out, out uh, of position or maybe off guard, and then you can maybe close down his advantage. So. Okay, bot lane, Phoenix move is going to happen right now. Perfectly stun everyone, wow. stunning Phoenix. Oh! Move. Wand by Phoenix. Oh! He oh. by. Laser is maxed, so he does not have that big slow. Okay, Kunka now falling. Oh, with the urns. Oh my goodness, what a yep. great play. Whoa. By the way, I'm man. Really like this Scourge's teamwork right now, Bob. This is just amazing to watch. They're just moving so perfectly. Oh the stuns are really well timed. But there goes Skywraith, just as I'm saying that. There he goes. <laughs> yep. He's taking now level 6. He took another kill on mid lane. I mean, you can expect, like, Sky will win 99% of the game on mid lane if he plays versus Tiny. So. He, Tiny must get some help if he wants to stay alive on lane. He must get some help from his teammates, definitely. He cannot survive there solo. Slarder getting heal right now from Wench. He will go full HP. Maybe another attempt for kill is going to happen very anytime soon. Oh yeah, Spec is already level 5 and they're obviously letting him get fed bot, so it's going to be exciting to see if Spec, you know, maybe goes Radiance or we'll see what he goes here. That might not be a bad item to go here in this game. Look at this mid lane now, Tiny again. Oh, missing ulti Skyrat on Tiny and Tiny will live. Oh, he has bottle full and also sticks. He should be fine, yeah. Now rotation is coming with Slardar and Wench. They're trying to catch maybe Skyrat off the guard. Oh, there he goes with haste. Okay. Yep. The guy's going after Tiny right now. Looks like he's got him. There is Slarder, man. There is Slarder, but it's too late right now, and Tiny will go down. Man. Okay, Stun is connecting. They, do they have enough damage? I don't think so, man. They will oh. need. 
help. <laughs> Phoenix is also there. Nice rotation from Phoenix. You know, Sky, I mean, whoever's playing Sky Rage right now is just, his timing is incredible. Every time it looks, oh, there we go, Spec. Here he's going. Oh. Can he take a kill on Skyra? That would be actually huge, but... Oh, barely alive. Oh. Nope, it's not going to happen. And oh that was very risky, man. Wow. That was a <laughs> risky move, man. He's taking over the game, Balt. Like we were just saying, the team game is important. You're so... But man, he is just... You know, they're trying to gank him right now, which I would definitely... They want to... They want to get him off his high, but... Top lane, top man. lane, Zeus is in danger, man. Low HP, he will go down. Necro solo killing. This is also a huge moment. Now mid lane. Tiny again. Yep. Ooh, look at oh this combo, man. <laughs> Did you see the combo like Torrent and Ulti from Skyrath? That was perfect. Oh, man. And the X marks the spot is perfect for his ult. That's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Spectre with only 10 creeps, man. And Sven, 35. That's a lot of creeps for Sven right now. He has that perfect farm. I mean, it could be even higher, but it's still fine. 36 creeps is a lot. 37 right now. Mid lane, Invis there on a starter. Oh, it's coming, oh, man. Here it comes. Yep, looks like we... Do we see? Yep, last oh! hit for Dainy. Nice they play, man. That That's huge. Yep, wow. huge pickup for them. They must kill that Skyrat if they want to stay in the game, in mid game especially. Once Sky gets like level 6, he's very dangerous and in every lane. And as you know, I love watching you play ball. I mean, rune control is so big. I mean, man, you get a lucky double damage, a lucky invisibility, that could be a game changer. True, man. Right there. Yep, true. Many people don't realize power of runes, so definitely game changers. That invis haste, insane. I would like to, like, if there is Ice Frog still updating map, I would suggest to make Blink rune. If you can use one charge for Blink. Can you imagine that rune? Man. Oh, top lane, Necro now. Necro in danger. Oh. Sludge got the ult, they can see him. Yep. Nice wow. gang there, man. Look at this movement. Four heroes attacking top lane, taking two kills. Perfectly done. Can they go safe back? Let's see. Sky is not trying to chase anyone on there. He's just going for tiny kill. And, you know, I'm really liking the Scourge gameplay. is really good right now. Yeah, they're hitting their stuns. They're playing as a team. It's fun to see. Yep, definitely. That's now... Okay, they're coming back in the game. Look at this perfect rotation Ooh, from Slarda. HP, my goodness. Spectre oh taking a gosh, kill, please. man. Did you, see how, did you see how he left him to pick up kill? Yes. Look at this now, mid lane. Okay, Slarda will leave there. No help for Kunka to finish the kill. And it's not level 6 yet ready on Kunka, so... Exactly. See with that rune control again. That's um, where we, you know we're gonna keep talking about that. That's that's gonna be big in this game. Yeah. So all about the little things in Dota: farming, rune control, playing smart, not taking stupid kills. That's how you win the game. Yeah, staying in good position is one of the best, like uh, most important ones actually. Seeing if Spec can now farm a little bit. Let's see. Yeah, there you go. Also, this guy so playing Sven is doing great job, like uh, using moment momentum to farm as much as he can at this point of the game because he's not focused yet. Top lane, Slarder now being under the attack. Man, ulti from Necro will bring down the Slarder, and now 60 seconds out of Slarder is a lot, man. That's a lot. And the Sentinel needed that. Scourge looked like they were kind of taking over the game, so that was a, that could be a big play for them. That's nice. Yeah, no, there is no ganks from him, so yeah, definitely. Slider can Sven even can farm even like harder now. He should not expect any ganks on him anytime soon. 
You know, Bolton, I've been watching a lot of your tournament so far. It's been so fun to watch, but pretty much every game, I feel like it's obvious who's going to win. This game, I have no idea right now. We're yeah, man. Yeah, really man. This is actually... You're right, bro. Like, uh, so far on tournament, even, uh, we couldn't pred predict many of this, but this one is so close on both sides. Teams playing good. They are making good rotations. So, look at this now. Top lane. Here they go. Oh, and... Okay. Say they're going back. Yeah, I think Smoking they would go. Heat. Wow, okay. Yeah, well, let's see if we can see another gank on top. When he's trying to catch Necro, let's see, can he do it? No swap, by the way. Nice stun there on Kunka and... It's done. Oh, what a play by Zeus. Yep, a late heal from Necro, by the way. A late heal. We're saying it's a it's a game of... You, you have to be perfect no, in Dota. You really do. You make one mistake in this game and you're you get to death. We missed the kill on on Tiny. Skyrats took a kill on Tiny. I, I see in scoreboard. A player's forces are under okay, I didn't see that. Oh wow! Here we go. When is that? Phoenix, Necro nice salty. Look at this, and now everybody must run from Phoenix. That's what I love about this hero, man. Look at this now. Spectra low HP. Oh boy. Torrent will connect nicely wow. done. Perfect, Perfect. Torrent. Man. And it's beautiful to watch. Yep, and almost level six. A player's forces are under attack. And but wasn't it so funny when Phoenix came out, if you remember, nobody knew how to kill him when he ulted. <laughs> that happened for like the first couple months, and then people are like, oh, that's right, you have to attack him. Yeah. So I just, yeah, but... I love seeing Phoenix, man. Yeah, I played Phoenix so much, man, when he came out. I even remember yeah. trying him first time with my friend, Tsanki. Tsanki was with me, one player from my stream, and also my friend from days back then. We played Phoenix. He had a laser different from this, I think. He had different spells, I'm not sure, like, Laser was much more overpowered. Okay, Sven, nice stun on Slardar, Torrent will connect, Slardar going down, but Kunkao we as well. Ult. Perfect Necro, ulti geez. from Necro. Looks like the momentum's gone back to the Sentinel. Yep. Oh, we gotta get Venge level 6, my goodness. Come on, Venge. Oh, look at this farm, look at this farm for Sven. Do you see farm for Sven, man, look at this. Wow. Yeah, look at that quick armlet, like we were saying. Yep. Wow. Yep. That's one I love watching you play Sven, man. Sven is, he is, he's a great hero, man. So overpowered mid game if he can get that. Yeah, level two ult, armlet, dagger, man. Oh yeah, he's a beast, bro. He's a beast. In mid game, he's in beast, but later in the game, he's falling down because he cannot chase kills. That's the main problem with Sven, especially against Spectra. Spectra can detect him before the fight starts. Okay. Oh, wow. What an ult. Triple, man. Triple heroes on, on Skyrat will bring him down. Perfectly rotation from Zeus and also Spectra. Egg will go down fast oh. enough. Oh. Look at Zeus giving Spec the kill, they're getting him fed. Yeah, bro, wow. that was also smooth. 11-11, Zeus and Spec, my goodness. That's a lot of damage. Oh, man. And they're okay. Look at the Sentinel, though. Top tower. Here we go. First tower of the game. Yep, in their favor. By the way, it is 17 kills for Sentinel, 14 kills for Scourge. Scourge playing Panda Team, Sentinel, Shock Game Club. By the way, pa Panda Team are favorites based on me and based on Amal decision. So we'll see if we were right or not. Right now, Shock Game Club doing great, great play, man. Top lane even now, bro. Look at this Zeus falling down very fast. There is ulti from Necro. What a play by Necro. Nicely done, man. Yeah. You know, Necro and Sky early game, but they're just so overpowered. I mean, if they can get their ult off, whoever they're going against is dead right away. And yeah, Necro is, I, I really like this Necro in this game. He's played fantastic. Yep. What is he on a killing screen? Dominating? Let's see. A player's force is Oof. Spectre stayed alive barely now. Wench going for Phoenix, actually. Solo there. Okay, Tiny is now joining fight. And now Good Phoenix gosh. will gosh. he... Oh! oh. <laughs> Look at the slow! <laughs> oh my gosh! Spec with a perfect dagger. Orin took a kill on Phoenix from Spectre. Perfectly done. Ship there is now going. Oh. 
Nice there play from goes. Sven. Double kill. Wow. And I think, yeah. I think like if. Okay, wait. Necro is now being attacked. There, nice swap from Venge, and now ulti from Zeus, killing one kill, two kills, taking one kill. Uh, it was somebody else died. Skyrat. Skyrat died there from Zeus ulti, man. Even he did not attempt like to kill Skyrat. He got bonus kill. Oof, Kunka going down. Even Sven could be in trouble, but he will live. Did you see combo from X? Okay, actually. Wait, Kunka died. Yeah, he axed actually Spectra before he died. Okay, okay. And, oh, what an amazing combo to have Zeus and, and Spectra. I mean, their ults are just ridiculous. It's just, it's so perfect. Wow, yeah, and their spec. Look at this mid lane smoke, bro. Better, better be careful. Yeah, that's... Yeah, oh, man. Nice play, brother. That's what we were saying. If you keep farming at low health, it's sometimes better to just go home. <laughs> yeah, brother. And he wanted actually to, to take that bling dagger. He need only 400 gold. And now he lost, like, he lost 200. Yeah. Actually, he needed maybe one, two creeps. Now it is 400 gold. In the time, my goodness. It, I, was, I was literally going to say that the Sentinel looks like they're in control, but what an amazing comeback by the Scourge. I mean, that was just a couple kills in a row, turns the game right back. Let's see what the Sentinel can do. Look at level 7. Okay, Sky. Let's see. And we got Spec farming. Wow, Spec's getting pretty fed himself. He got madness for getting faster creeps in jungle. I'm not sure if he will go now. Radiance, most of the people in high skill games, they go for Yasha first and then they go for Radiance. So yeah. let's see. Now with uh, Tiny, with Bling Dagger, he can deal a lot of damage to many of, of Shad oh, Game Club he, heroes. Look, here we got smoke. Here we go, Sentinel. Oh my gosh, here it comes. Oh, silence on Tiny actually, man. And he will go down. What a counter attack. Silence, stop Tiny to nuke. Oh man, they're coming right out. Look at the great comeback by the Sentinel. What great yeah. team play. Yep, All that four heroes went together and they used that They used that smoke at the seat. That's perfect. Okay, Ulti Spectre. They're trying to bring down Necro now. Uh, Skyrot is dead, by the way. Slarder, he will be alive. Wow. Nice combo. Great ult. Next Triple kill. Oh my, oh my god, god, bro. God. Oh! Ho, ho! You got Ultra it, I was like, he's gonna go down, like... Dude, that's wow. team vibe, brother. That's team vibe for Game Shock, Shock Game Club. Wow. I mean, you said it, but the Zeus Spectra combo is beautiful. My goodness. Yeah, man, it's insane. It's insane. I don't know, how do you stop this? Wow, and then there we go with the bot tower. Huge. How do how would you stop this combo by the way? How would you stop this combo? I yeah. mean my goodness. Uh, how do you stop the combo? Well hopefully you can pick off Zeus first. That that's what I'm doing to be honest, because even right now let's see what item Zeus has. Yeah, Zeus has no escape. That's how I'm, that's how I'm stopping the combo is I'm putting all my energy to stop Zeus. He doesn't have a dagger, he doesn't have ethereal, you know, very easy to kill right now. Um, that, that would be that'd be my way, man. I try to gank Zeus before we get into the team battle. Yeah, man. What about you? Yeah, I would agree definitely with you. To if you can find Zeus before fight starts, that would be perfect. But you must have something like Bat Rider there on team, something like that to scout. You know. Mm. Oh, tiny jumping oh, Phoenix nice missing. Nice by Phoenix. Phoenix yeah. Dive. Also, if you can actually spot Spectra uh, before. Fight starts five versus five. If you can find Spectra, he's farming more than Zeus in this time. If this uh, in this phase of the game, as you can see, Spectra top lane saying solo there now. Skyward going for her. Okay, and now Spectra is in big trouble here. Back. Yep, one more hit will do it. Oh, one more first wow. kill. Oh, it looks like he's gonna get away. Yep. I mean, my goodness, the Sentinel needs Zeus right now, Bob. Yeah, brother. <laughs> they need an ult. <laughs> there is not enough items on Skyra to deal out many damage. That's why that's why Sky, uh, Spectra actually survived. 
Smart play by Spec just to run. That's sometimes the best move to do is don't even... You're, you're getting ganked. You have a good hero coming at you. Just run. You're exactly right. He didn't have enough. Forces are under attack. Nice play by Spec. Yeah, and how games goes, uh, how game goes uh, later and on, it will be even harder to kill Spec shot, so... We'll see, we'll see how it goes. By the way, there is always Necro in team. Necro is insane against Spectra, and I would say if he can use ulti, that will be 5 versus 4, and then they have strong chance to win the fight. So, the question is, can they find Spectra with ulti from Necro? That's the main question. Mm. Yeah, you're exactly right, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna say what I said last time. If you can get Zeus in that team, like, Zeus has no escape. So if he's not, if you can find him, if you can pick him off any way, that's just huge. Because Zeus is doing the bulk of the damage. Yeah, that but... Bolt, his, it's, the, you know, chain the, lightning. The point is, damage. he's always staying behind, you know. You can see Zeus is always the last hero there. He is actually a ranged damage dealer, so, you know. Oh, ship will miss. There goes, there, there's that ult, the double ult. Skyrot. Phoenix with a nice ult. Staying alive, nice ulti from Spectra on Slaughter, but he will go down only now. Sven jumping on Zeus, can he take a kill? There is no BKB on Sven, he's tossed, and now he's low HP. Wow. Spectra oh. will take a kill. Nice play. Zeus died, by the way. Oh my god, Spe wow, Skyrat also died. Amazing, nice play from Tiny, jumping on Phoenix, a taking the forward. kill. Now Necro, one man alive. He cannot stay long alive. That will be another kill for Spectra. Actually, Tiny Ow. last hit him. Tiny, hey. Yeah, he's like, better kill him before he ki heals again. Absolutely. And this Spectra is just playing so perfect right now, Bob. I've been so impressed. I mean, he's just... His ults are always at perfect times. Look at that. He's going for the quick Radiance like we were talking about. Yep. I'm ex when they get that Radiance, that could be game over for Sentinel. Yeah, especially because Sven cannot use Blink Dagger then, and also Necro Blinks cannot be used against Radiance, and then you are in trouble. Squishy heroes like Skyrat and also Kunkka will die fast. Same with Phoenix. Players' forces are under attack. Sven now trying to find farm for BKB. Probably he must get it also against Spectra, against Tiny, against Zeus. You cannot survive too long. And he must get now BKB. That's very important item. And as I said, as games goes uh, longer, it will be even harder to kill Spectra and all heroes, so... Late game, it should be in hands of Panda team in third side. Yeah, you're so right, and look at Spec, he's already got the Radiance, and I mean, last battle we saw it, Sven, he couldn't even get an attack off. And that's, I mean, Sven is everything, Sven needs that BKB, he needs to be able to... He's got to do some damage. If he's getting stunned, yeah. he's literally worthless. So. Yeah, true. Like, you can have the biggest damage in the game if you cannot deal it. And, like, no point. A player's forces are under attack. Scourge is doing really... They're playing very smart. Oh, and here we go. Both of them top. I'm surprised to see, like, uh, Sven farming there deeply alone and no one is trying to gank him. Mid lane... Oof, Necro going for Tiny, Torrent will They're miss. Nice dagger. Okay, this is really ulti from Spectra, I'm not sure. Wow. Okay, Phoenix Sag is used. Phoenix. Ooh, Kunka ship. Oh, oh, man. One second late, but Tiny is dead anyway. Nice play there for Sentinel's side, I would say, right now. Skyrat going too aggressive there, Slaughter will stun, and Skyrat going very fast down. Nice Torrent to on Slaughter. Spectra's just taking over the game now, Ball. Yeah, man. Like, Spectra is surviving every fight, man. And it's not looking good for Sentinel side, for Shock Game Club. It's not looking good. If Spectra survives every fight, man, how? what do you expect in late game? What do you expect, man? In late game, it will be even harder. And ulti is always from Necro placed on Slarder, not even once on Spectra. So I'm really curious, so why is that? 
And you know, Kunka had a nice torrent and a nice ult, but it was just a second late. Phoenix had one more second on that ult, and that could have been the game changer. But yeah, the Sentinels, the it's gonna be tough right now, man. I, the Scourge has got a, they're in full control. Wow. Yeah, how do you come back now? You must kill Spectra with Necro at least one or two times. Yep, they have to. Look at this, wow. 3,000 gold on Spectra, and now he can get, like, even Manta style, and then it is almost impossible mission to kill him. We got Sven, yeah. He needs that level 16, which he will be soon. Yeah, Sentinel's got to be real careful here. That if, they don't, if they don't play perfect, it could be game over. Yeah, and the reason why I say Spectra is one of the strongest heroes in 5 vs 5 game is because he can farm like wherever he wants and he can join fight anytime, man. Anytime he can join fight, which is like you're always in good position. You cannot be out of position. You're always in good position. Yeah, and because a lot of, I mean, the Sentinel's pretty weak right now. They, lay, they don't really have a tank, so... I mean, of course, Phoenix with his ult, but that Radiance is literally, he's taking him down with just their ult. It's a man. Here we go with the Scourge. Yep, they're going for smoke. I think we are Russian going to see Russian kill. And if yep. maybe Sentinel go, if they go for defending Rosh, that could be also very interesting. But they don't yeah. know about look Rosh. What got, look what we got going on so far. <laughs> they got they messed up a little bit, yeah. They're yep. really being patient, that's... Look Look at the ward control, Balt. I know you're big on that as well. Look, they got the whole forest. They know nobody's coming. That's just, that's the absolutely beautiful. Are under attack. Wow. The town is under siege. Oh man, if Spec gets that eye, I guess, yeah, that could be, that could be game. Yeah, I don't see then how do you kill Spectra two times. I don't see the wow. way. And he's got Yasha. My goodness, yeah, he could go, he could go Sanger Yasha. I'd like to see Manta though, too. Tiny. Oh, he will wow. live. Look at this. Instant kill on Kunka, by the way. Yep. Phoenix with a nice one. There we go. Oh, he survived by Spectra. Low HP with Aegis. Oh, Tiny. Nice you. My Necro takes Ooh. down Tiny. Yeah, that is actually a good one. But Spectra still alive, man. Aegis. Okay. Nice kill. Wow, that I guess is huge. Oh, damn, man. Slaughter died, but Spectra will live another fight, man. And that's not good. Buyback from Tiny, by the way. A player's forces are under attack. A town is under siege. Spectra is real problem, man. Oh, Tiny going for Phoenix. That's aggressive move there. Your Scepter will be popped and now he will be fine. We have drop. Okay. Yep. He will be disconnected maybe. Yeah. There we go. That's actually grabbing my charger too, man. That's hilarious. <laughs> Both of us needed a little break. There we go. Man, it, li it looks like Panda team is trying to finish the game right now. Tiny buyback, that means they will push mid lane. There is 30 seconds left, 28 seconds left until Necro spawns and also who is yellow is Kyrat. Yeah, he is second spawning. I think that's not enough time to take Rex, definitely. I think Panda, yeah, team, I Panda team without Aghanim so tiny, they cannot push very fast, so... Okay, they lost light, you can drop. The game's the game goes on. A player scores and is in attack. Yeah, and the Scourge is just taking mid right now. You're right, they can they can take Rax and end the game. Mm, let's see if they will go for Rex. I'm not sure. I think they will wait for ulti from Spectra another and then from Zeus. Zeus has refresher, man. How do you survive now this? <laughs> That's like 2,000 damage for each hero, man. <laughs> oh, man. That should yeah, be Rampage, man. 
that mid game that we were talking about is so key and spectra had a couple just beautiful ults and sentinel had a chance with phoenix ult different things but they missed and once he got fed it just looked like the game was over now that radiance man he i mean a quick radiance it's just sentinel's gonna need some some crazy plays here to take the game back yeah they're just being smart they're taking towers right now getting gold being smart no rush Okay, they are going for top lane for Spectrack. They want to maybe focus. Let's see. Oh, Swan is going too deep, man. He's jumping on Zeus. BKB pop. Oh, Can they take BKB. a kill? There's the BKB. Oh, Here he goes. Finally, man. They took a kill Ooh. on Zeus before ulti. Nice double Respect. kill. Wow. This is their chance. <laughs> Three oh, kill my heroes dead. Great ult by Necro. Man. Spectra came in late. Finally, Whoa. Spectra died. But Sven died as well. Necro, staying alive. No, Spectra is... That's illusion, actually. I, I was surprised to see, like, what is happening. This. Okay. Wow, and Vault, you know, I was so surprised. We've seen some great ults from Spectra, like you said. He's always coming in. He didn't come in. And they just, they all died. Sven went BKB, and he just took Zeus right down. Yeah, that's that was fast kill. Come. Yeah, fast kill, he man. Hits, and that, if he that... Hits Zeus quickly, I mean, the, the game shifts. The game shifts, and you're right. That was the one time Zeus wasn't back, just hiding. He got <laughs> Sven with God's strength, BKB, and a stun. He's done. <laughs> yeah, man. He caught him out of the guard, and that's what they need to do if they want to catch him. You must jump when they don't expect. So... That's what I like to use in my games when I... When my team is falling down, like we are dying, we are losing the game. I like to fight when the enemy team don't think I would fight. So you just go for it, you know. For example, I think uh, Panda team, they w they wanted to take this tower and they thought no one will defend. And that was crucial moment. And I, I, I like what you said. It's like when you're down, you just got to go for it. You know, you're <laughs> the game. You probably don't have the game. And Spence has made a great choice. He said, I might as well go in. And that BKB was huge. He's done a good job of farming the whole game. The yeah, I think if he can do it one more time, but this time attacking Spectra, going for it, and then Necro ulti can connect, I think that's the opening for the comeback. That's the opening for the comeback. They must take a kill on Spectra. Without BKB on Spectra, you can finish the game. And Necro has that Aghanim Scepter, which, which uh, will provide that buyback counter you know you cannot buy back when you're ulted from necro so that could be a real game changer and then it could be comeback for sentinel side shock game club and here we go middle we got tiny and venge by the way oh, well before things get again too crazy i'm just gonna say it quick for my followers hey if you guys are watching right now I'm with the Baltazar TV. He runs an amazing channel. He's a professional gamer. 200,000 subscribers. Go to YouTube right now, guys. Check it out. Like. Send a comment as well if you're watching from Instagram. Thanks, Oliver. Uh, by the way, the guy who dropped from the game, it's actually Sven, man. Actually, Sven is Sven being played from one of the players from this four. Either Fe Phoenix or somebody from his team is playing with... With Sven, he dropped from the game. A player's Ball, isn't that funny how sometimes when a player leaves, I don't want to say in this game, because we got a lot of good players, but sometimes when a player leaves, they'll use that player as a perfect bait, and here we go! Oh! BKB! Oh! Oh my gosh! Oh, Sven is... From Phoenix. Wow! Another stun, nice, Great but stun. there is Necro, oh. man. Go for ulti, brother. Oh, did he throw the ulti? Oh, he cannot connect ulti on Spectra and he's using on the Zeus, man. Oh, oh man. my god, perfect play from Necro. He cannot go back. He's trying to there take a kill on another one, kill. man. There's a dagger mm. on the ground. Oh my god, man. <laughs> 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 okay, okay, that's big, bro. There is no gold for another blink for Tiny, man, and that's big one. That's huge. Yeah, my goodness. See you later, <laughs> friend. <laughs> so does the game. You can't make mistakes. You can't just drop items out here, guys. Come on now. <laughs> Necro running around with two daggers. That's great. Oh, man. 
know if I've ever seen that. That's fantastic. Man, I love it. I love it. That was dangerous move. He tried to drop blink and then to blink out after cooldown is ready. That's <laughs> that. That's dangerous move, man. That's okay. Hey, you know, that's a, that's a part of Dota 2. You know, we all make mistakes. You know, how can hopefully Tiny can bounce back from that? But yeah, look at Spec right now. He's got the Scatty. He's almost level 25. So he, I mean, I, I'd like to see the Scourge try to push. You know, see if they can if they can take down uh, get some racks. Sentinel staying strong. I'm very impressed. They're using Sven well, even though he left. Man, I think playing the team relaxed a lot after one guy left the game and now they're in trouble. And I wonder if somebody can... Oh, wow. What do we got going on mid? Uh, just an illusion. Oh, I think another push is coming mid lane this time from Shock Game Club. They want to go for more. They don't want to wait. They're going with uh, five heroes, bro. There is no blink on Tiny, man. This is funny, man. This is funny. <laughs> and we got Phoenix level 16 now, Ball. That's huge. Now he's got, I believe it's 11 attacks, so. Yeah, that that's a big. lot. That's a lot, bro. You cannot bring Phoenix down right now very easily. He needs that mech. It's going to be big for them. Zeus can get off his ult with the refresher, my goodness. So, Sentinel needs to try to stop him quick. Here goes Sven, he's about to jump in. Spectre is pushing, by the way, top lane. Wow, yep. Skadion, Spectre with Manta, Radiance, 4,000 gold in bank. He can buy back easily if he dies. Sven going aggressive. There he goes. Oh, there he goes. BKB perfectly. What a perfect BKB on the bench. Ulti from Phoenix. Oh, BKB on Spectra, man. Wow. Oof, Skyra died. Sven now dying very fast. Ulti from Necro, man. Ulti from Necro will be thrown on Spectra, and Spectra will be dead for 130 seconds. Necro died as well, by the way. Wow. Yeah, I don't know if I agree with the Sentinel pushing right there, but it's like. It maybe got a little too over aggressive now. Scourge is just. They got the game. Man, perfect ulti from Necro, I have to say. That was really perfect. Wow, and here we go. They're trying to make a little push mid. Let's see if they can. Yeah. It's gonna be tough. Tunka's a great hero for holding off towers as well, so if he can get a decent ult or just even just a good torrent and attack, it should be fine. Let's see. I think okay Necro buyback actually. I'm not sure why did he buy back actually. I I would agree. I I definitely would have waited. Man, maybe they wanted to defend Rosh Rosh, let's see. And that could be actually a very good move if defend uh, if they go for defending Rosh, that's very important. Spectra cannot get another Aegis. If he gets another Aegis, man, 40 seconds for Spectra to respawn. Oh, they want to push actually, 40 seconds they have. They want to go push this. And this Necro ball, I mean, he's gotten, we've, we've talked about the Sky, we've talked about Sven, we've talked about Spec, but Necro... Uh, he's he's doing a great job of carrying right now. My goodness! Like you said, he had the amazing ult last the last team battle. So let's see what he does here. Yep. Oh, they don't have enough time to push. Like they must hurry up, man. Sven ulti is going right now. They want ah, to go for push. <laughs> Ten seconds. Ten seconds. I don't know if that's enough, man. There, hey, there goes Zeus. He survived. He survived. Oh my god. Phoenix Sunray. Oh my goodness. Zeus with 100 HP. Oh my goodness. Oh, Necro will die another time, man. Bad play. They panicked. Wow. Oh my goodness. 
goodness. Hey, man. This did not look good. 90 seconds dead for Necro. I don't see now comeback for them. Yeah, and Balt, they missed Zeus by 100 HP. That's just, it's, we talk about it, so this is a game of, you have to hit your ult, you have to hit plays at the right time, and they missed. And now Scourge has a perfect opportunity to push. They got bot lane push too. Wow. Let's see what happens here. We can see some mid racks pretty quick. Nah. All players from the Sentinel right now dead. <laughs> oh my gosh. Man, it's not enough time, 40 seconds to push mid lane. I think that was a mistake. Also, Ulti Necro on Zeus was a very big mistake. I think they need to save it for Spectrum, man. It's the most hardest hero to kill right now. Okay, we got Kunka, but you're so right. They need, they need to use it on Spectrum, but he was dead, right? So they, they kind of attacked too soon. Yeah. Oh, there. Come on, Kunka. We got to see something out here. There is not enough time. Oh, by the way, Tiny got another blink. Hey, see, there we go. He may he bounce back. Oh, they didn't get the racks yet. Nice torrent. We're going up the sky. Wow. Just like butter. Man, yeah, they want... Combo. Ah, bro. They are oh! trying... They are trying too hard to defend, man. That's not good. Look at this now. That's too hard, yeah, bro. They're all going in. Yeah. Better call was yeah. maybe to let it go down, man. Fight another time. You're so right, man. And rather than teaming up, they all went in one at a time. Oh, uh, there goes Necro. Yep. They're all going in one at a time, Bolt. <laughs> That's yep. It. We are going to watch next game, man. They lost. Actually, it was very nice, interesting game. What an incredible. I mean, hey. We gotta shout out the, the, the team play though. Venge played great, Slar did his job, and uh, you know, Tiny, but obviously the big players of the game, Spec and Zeus, just absolutely amazing. And big shout outs to Spec for getting that quick radiance. That was just so impressive. Like 25 minutes he already had the radiance? Oh, my goodness. Yeah, that was really fast farm. <laughs> Alright, look at that. Hey! Look at that 11. Yep. Oh, if we could have seen Phoenix do that in a big team battle, this could be a, that could have been a different game, man. Triple kill. Man, triple kill. <laughs> <laughs> Will they actually surrender? Yeah, actually everybody left, so only only Phoenix is uh, there. Oh, man. Phoenix getting that ki that kill the death ratio a little better, Bob, for the game ends. <laughs> <laughs> Can Slarda take a kill here? Torrent will oh. hit. Ship will hit. Yep. Nope. But, yep, Slarda will go down. Oh, nice play by Phoenix. Okay, game number one is done. Nice play there from Panda. Let's see another game. Game number two. Well, who was your favorite player that last game? Who do you feel like made the biggest uh, uh, the biggest contribution that game? I have to say a lot of nice rotation from Slardar, definitely, in the beginning. He did a really good job, man. He created space for his teammates.